since we've been on the last trip. Went to Yowl and there's been a lot of repairs and maintenance done to the car since then. We've had to do, actually JB, thank you very much, he's given me a hand and we've welded a rim. One of the aluminium rims had a crack in it. Not so good, just found another problem in the rim. First attempt, getting there, but not really. We'll see how we go, second attempt. Paint hides everything. See how the, <laughs> see how the master does it. Back up, it's holding so far. The rear bar was from Yow, I've placed an order, it's been about eight and a half weeks and still waiting for a Kmar bar to arrive. Uh, we've redone the roof. I've obviously had the roof rack sitting too high and put too much weight. So there's been a little bit too much movement and you know, structural parts in the uh, where the tie down points are. We've had to make them a lot more sturdy to hold the weight. It is definitely broke. Some brackets, there's the ones we've made, just lice in the front. I'm happy with that. Got a good seal all the way around. Let's have a look on the inside. Yeah. Let's change that boot on one of the airbags. Managed to get Jamie under his car, ripping out the old boot. It just moved and the clip come off, just wear and tear. Oh. <laughs> Have we picked up yet that it's me doing all the work again and Paul just filming? Compared to the old one, it's a lot more pliable, so it should be pretty easy, hey? Let's see if we can get a little bit of lube just around the, uh, we'll say the knob. A bit of lube did the job, straight over the knob. Done. But besides from that, the car's going well. Um, here comes Lithgow and hopefully nowhere near as much damage. Let's see what happens. Back with the crew from Truck and Trail Adventures, TTS. And we're heading back to Lithgow for another crack at that with a bigger crew. We've got like 10 cars this time. It's most of the boys from the Yowl trip and Toby and Stewie in the Jeep. We're gonna go and check out all the tracks that, you know, some of the ones we haven't done and most of the hard ones. So we'll see how that goes. Ones like Pipeline, uh, Ali Barber's Cave, Spanish Steps, uh, Ranger Bobs, uh, the power lines there. Really looking forward to it. Hopefully we have a good time. So yeah, we'll pick it up in the morning. Look at this bloody it's not artistic. It's not, it's not focusing. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Stupid thing. Cheek. Brand new, got plastic on it, and you can take selfies and see what you're doing. You can. Look at the size of the screen. That's awesome. I'm good looking. <laughs> Enjoying your laps. Have you got any maps? I've got hammer. Yeah. I, 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 I bought the pod packer. I should have gone a bit more. This thing is fucking shit. Do not buy one. <laughs> it just doesn't register. You gotta hold it on for hours. Hours. There's about 15 different types in Super Cheap, and this was one of them. You got the wrong one. What is it? I don't know. It's the same as the front, apparently. <laughs> 
it hasn't updated, so it's probably fucking. <laughs> What? Camera's back in under your fridge. It's in deep, eh? Get in there. Is it too early to have chips? <laughs> I think you've already started, haven't you? It's never too early to have chips. <laughs> I'm not over chips. I got it, I got it. If you got oh, it, you fucking his hand hands in there. Never too early for chips. Mm. <laughs> oh, get back be, there, bro. Gotta be an easier way. Get in there. How do I get in there? Get into it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Got him. Good job. I just stumbled across this stash. You've got to be kidding me. This is one day. one day. This is just humbugs, black cats, barbecue chips, raspberry bullets, and strawberries and cream that he's already eaten half of them. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> It's nice to have these back in the line. Oh, that. <laughs> well, yeah, at least you can. Well, quite well, hopefully, you're not going to bend the bar. So we're on the on the way at the very top of the drop in to Ali Barber's cave, I think. So you know, it looks like we're going to jump out, have a look, uh, make a call about it. I think all the big rigs will obviously go in, but we'll see about the rest of us. Or well, me, anyway. <laughs> yeah, everyone's out having a look. This is exciting. First bit of tough stuff for the day, by the look of it. Oh <laughs> yeah. Just go straight down. Just go straight down. Awesome view, eh? Yeah, I know. <laughs> Is there a walk into the cave or? I think you drive into it. You can literally really? park in the oh, thing. No. I'll tell you where it wants to go. I was about to say, yeah, <laughs> yeah that's exactly right. As you're going uphill and the front wheels are in the air, you're going to yeah, go where it is. I think uh, it's a miss for me. I'm going to be camera crew. Playing camera crew for this one. Pussy and out, there's a few of us bailing, so. What's your car again, 100, is it 100? Yep. Are you taking it down? Yeah, I'll give it a crack, see how this goes. That's it, that was just a tow hitch.
Yeah, this is pretty full on. If you ever driven this, good for you. Well done. <laughs> Some of those big rigs having a go, but how good, how nice is the spot? Bloody amazing. Really nice area. Wing is bringing it down. Big cruiser, twin lock now. Couple of mods done. That's it. in that shot. Oh yeah. Just there. Black, green screen. Just hard, yeah, hard can't see it in the dark. We'll pull up the green screen. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's right. <laughs> I might be able to figure that bit out. Cool spot, hey? Amazing. Yeah. on that hit the rock 
with your left tire, hit that rock. Yep. Turn hard left, turn hard left. Stay high on the right, stay high on the right. Look at this guy. Good fun. Well done. Lucky. Good drive though. <laughs> Good drive. Man. Easy mate, easy. Perfect mate, perfect. Straight line there, straight line. Footage. Yeah, epic. Yeah, very cool. Because yeah. you stopped, yeah, you just kept going. Yeah. Verdict? Good, fun. Good track, yeah. <laughs> Real good. It was, you, it you was your track, track and you didn't even go down there, mate. No, no. <laughs> I walked it three times. Right? <laughs> yeah. Ten Louis. Quarter past twelve, and we're leaving Ali Barber's Cave. That took a while. Got a fair few cars down there, parked up at the bottom, got the photo, and then back in out of there. There's that one corner at the bottom that's pretty full on and uh, there's a few winches. So now we're going towards pipeline, maybe play around on the, on the power lines a little bit, but uh, it's pretty much lunchtime. Half of the boys had lunch and 
the other half haven't, so we'll see how we go. There's my cameraman. Oh, no, there he is. Alright, I might put this up the top. Hello, cousin! You must be spitting bullets, that's serious stuff what you're doing. <laughs> you're amazing, you are. What's your name? <laughs> I want to... <laughs> Legend. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the man. <laughs> you'll get that, you'll get that. <laughs> Do we need to put it on record that you just reversed out of something for the very first time? Yeah, we Never, I'm highly really disappointed. <laughs> what's, a, what's a date, Louis? Yeah, yeah mark that down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you got, oh, you got that laptop oh, and the Wi Fi? 4 58 and the 14th of November. <laughs> Myth backed out. Spewing. Spewing. I wasn't happy. I said one more time and four times. <laughs> Here we are, I've run all this way for a face-to-face -face interview with the man himself! Face to face! You oh, have smashed the rear bar. Have I? Yep. Join the club, brother. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was alright, I'm fucking a monkey guy. <laughs> uh, that was worth that run. Anyway, 
Um, in 800 the meters, have, at the roundabout, and take and the second I'm exit and stay on Monaro slowly. Highway B23. Fully lowered, bro. Go up. Fuck yeah, look at that, mate. I can see my mags in the car. <laughs> What's he talking about? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Go again. Oh, your going up. oh shit. Oh no. Need a new compressor again. Oh, compressor, no. it's gonna work. Oh, there it comes. <laughs> Come on, Louie, get in it! Yeah, you got to see that, Louie. Because I uh, had that BMS, that was a waste. Really? Yeah, because I was tossing off trying to get in a BMS, and I was going to buy one of those HX1s, and I thought, oh, I've got the iPad. Why well, spend 700 bucks on a screen yeah. for it? And, yeah. Mate, Jeez, if you look at watch four drive action, you know the BMS is fucking top notch. <laughs> every time all the waypoint in it. Yeah, yeah, every time we wanted to go there, it was like, mm. you're Fucking kid. I went through the same sort of like thought process of buying that where I go to spend extra money and get a turbo diesel, like the diesel model. Yeah. But, yeah, I don't know. A lot of extra yeah. money, hey? Yeah. And you've got a lot of extra problems too. Like if, if those go bang, they go bang pretty hard. These Pickle. things aren't, aren't that bad. If you, get, if you get water in these and they'll just cough and splutter a bit, then you can pull it off. Put an LS in it. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Everyone's done the conversions and stuff. Yeah. So. There's kits for them these going back to bottom up. Yeah. And they're not that bad on fuel. Like I used. I was, like, on the way here I used 20 litres a hundred, which is like, it's bad, but it's not. Yeah. 20, That's 20 litres per hundred. But still, That's look bad. at it though. The best I've got it. You would expect that. Yeah. The best I've got it was, I went, when I went to Grouse to get the drawers fitted, that one got that down, I got down to 18 litres a hundred on the highway. Yeah, <laughs> who'd have been, I seen that old bait in the LS1, you know, you just yeah. get to the top. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> just spins the wheel. Did you see all the jerry cans he was carrying on the road? Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> He was getting almost 30 litres, so it was like 10 more litres of that. Wow! Yeah, he said it's horrific than that thing. Yeah. <laughs> I did see all the jerrys up there. Yeah, he had like four of those little jerrys up there. He said, yeah, it's kept putting fuel in But he wasn't, he wasn't light on the foot either. Nah, like, nah. Like, nah was, he was off a limit of four. <laughs> like, multiple. He would have burnt 20 litres of stuff on the top of the mud there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, That's hitting, right. hitting the limit of a <laughs> limit of bash. Oh, fuck if I could, I would too. Yeah, it would you? Mate. Oh, I still haven't done it. You, you haven't hit it? No. <laughs> Not Have game. You tried? Hey? Have you, you tried? No, I haven't tried. You've got to know where your limits are, Louie. Hey? You've got to know where your limits are. <laughs> there's there's, there's about do. that much red, so you can go into the red. Just like. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just worried it won't have one and it'll just go off the clock. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's got one. Yes, it'll be like, <laughs> what did you do? What, um, what year model is your Calais? 2013, I think. It's a bloody beast. Yeah, it's a it's a series one. Yeah, look at him. Nah, fuck it. We need a family car. Oh, that looks good. <laughs> <laughs> 25 litres for. So you made the decision like you bought. It was a bit of a mutual thing. I've fucking wanted a V8. So who gets my entire it? life? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Is that your first V8? Yeah. Oh fuck. Yeah, and she yeah she was like yeah that's sick let's get that. We didn't know the Calais had V8s. But she's been driving it ever since. Yeah, she loves it. Oh, so that's her family, that's her car. Okay. Oh yeah, right on.